Nicole Scott here for Netbook News, and here we have the HP Mini 210 HD, so it does have a high-definition screen. If we just take a quick look at the unit, it's got the glossy display and the chiclet keyboard. So, but what we're, what we're doing today is we're going to be upgrading um, this with the Broadcom HD card. So I got this in the mail, it came with a, in this little priority box here, pretty easy. So now this model does come with the extended battery. Let's just pop this out. You check out, this has 5,100 milliampere battery and we're about to run uh, the battery test on this so we will let you know in the review how long this does last. Now the cool part about this, the HD now is that you can just pull these down this one's in. No, I think that one's down. Let's see. Ow. <laughs> you can see in there, we've got these orange tabs. And there's actually no SIM card slot there. But this one you just pull out, and this one, I'm still working on how you get that one out. Mm -hmm. So I've actually chipped my nail polish, getting this off. And you'll see, you actually need to rip harder than you think. You really need to pull back fairly hard in order to get this off. So we're just going to fast forward through my week. Before right, you give it a good yank. All right. So the back cover's off. And you, you see if you push down on these, they just release the latches there. So we're just going to stick this Broadcom HD encoder into this PCI slot here. First I went and got my screwdriver and we're just going to undo this screw here. Okay, there we go. So now we'll just slide the Broadcom chip in. Move that wire back. Okay, there and it snaps in. And we're just going to drop this screw into that hole there. And then we're just going to tighten that up. All right. So there we have it, easy peasy. We've installed the Broadcom HD encoder, and now we're going to get into some testing.